Philadelphia police have released some surveillance pictures of a man that they say it's wanted for raping a woman at gunpoint in a SEPTA station. Investigators saying it all happened earlier this morning while the suspect forced the victim's boyfriend to watch this. Action News reporter Julian Mealy live outside the Special Victims Unit there in Hunting Park with the latest on this investigation, including a Julian, a closer look at these surveillance pictures. Well, that's right, Gray, and we will show you that in just a second. This happened right around the time the station was opening for the morning commute. SEPTA tells me the subway trains start operating around 445, and you mentioned those pictures that we have. SEPTA cameras were able to capture images of the suspect the police are looking for, and they want you to take a look and notice a distinctive article of clothing. This man wearing a gray NASA hooded sweatshirt riding a bike was last seen heading north on Broad Street from the Snyder SEPTA station in South Philadelphia. Police say he is wanted for raping a 40 year old woman on the SEPTA platform around 430 this morning. Our survivor was with a boyfriend of hers. Uh, we know that she was uh, trying on some clothes and they were down there. You don't see anybody else in the video and then our uh, our offender arrives at the scene. Police say the woman's boyfriend and the suspect had a brief encounter and minutes later we pointed the gun at the boyfriend and put the gun at the back of our survivor and then proceeded to demand that he, uh, sex. She described the gun as a black Glock style gun, not necessarily a Glock, but a Glock style gun with a extended magazine that was green in color. This is not the first time a woman got raped or assaulted in the subway. And I think they need to have security guards, you know, down here. On April 24th, a rape occurred on the SEPTA Broad Street line between the Erie and Girard Avenue stations. A suspect was taken into custody for that incident. And according to SEPTA public data, between January and March, there was at least one other rape this year. SEPTA says it, quote, knows that riders have concerns about safety and security on the system, and we are addressing them. We are working to increase the visibility of police officers on the system. People who live in the area say more needs to be done. It's not safe at all. It looked like many Kensington. I think it's sad, but I'm not surprised because everything goes on down there. Everything. Now, police also say the man appears to be in his mid 20s. They say he's about five foot six, roughly 160 pounds. If you have any information, they want to hear from you. Reporting live outside of Special Victims Unit, I'm Jillian Mealy, Channel 6 Action News. Sarah. Jill